the button. Yes, this episode from SML rocks. I will give you reasons why this episode rocks in my opinion. The video starts with Candy twerking and with Toad throwing money at her. Junior realized she was someone's daughter too, but Toad didn't care. Toad also said she made her thirsty, making Junior go to Chef PP to get something to drink, even though Toad didn't mean he was literally thirsty. Junior went to the kitchen and told Chef PP to give him and Toad some drinks, then Chef PP showed him the no button he invented. Junior asked a question, then press on it, saying no, which made Chef PP laugh. Junior tried asking a few more questions and it always gave the same answer, which is no. Junior cried. Toad was also seen crying because Candy took all of his money and left him. Junior explained why he was sad too, and it was because of the button, explaining about it. Toad told him to reword the question so that it would say yes, like instead of can I go to the park? And it would say no, they would say can I not go to the park? And it would still say no. Junior thought it was a smart idea. Meanwhile, Chef PP bought a pineapple, then he put it in the kitchen. He bumped into Junior and told him to use the button. While Chef PP was showering, firstly, Junior asked if he could not hammer the pineapple, then Toad hammered it. Next, they asked about Bowser's jello, then they asked if they could not throw it in the cabinet, then they did so. Finally, they asked if they could not play with water guns, then they did it. After Chef PP's shower, he saw the mess in the kitchen and displayed absolute terror presumably realizing that if Bowser finds out about this he was going to get the blame. Moreover, he saw Junior and Toad playing with water guns. Chef PP was mad by the fact that Junior and Toad tricked the button. Furthermore Chef PP angrily yanks the gun away from Junior and goes to tell Bowser about what he did. Thinking his father was going to punish him for his actions Junior began to quickly panic. Him and Chef PP entered the room but Bowser who was busy watching Candy Twerk yells at both of them telling them to get out. Chef PP upon realizing this and further realizing that he didn't want to be a tattletale anyways decides of a better way to get revenge on Junior to which he does by, making him lick the entire floor with his tongue. The episode ends as Candy's father walks into the apartment and angrily scolds her for what is believed to be an earlier manner she previously did to Junior and his father. And that's how the episode goes, you should go this episode, it's an amazing episode. Anyways, do you know who likes this episode, Michael the Rapper Offline Guy and Jake's, Foley, for Michael the Rapper Offline Guy, he made a salute on this episode, as for Jake's Foley, he told me to put him in this spot, so the button rocks, and so does Bowser Jr. goes to the sun, locked out sucks.